morning stream here on Twitch. I control the cool steel again. Uh, where were we? Oh yes, we we're about to start the uh, the. Oh, what happened there? <laughs> Sent it all a bit funny. Right, yes, we were about to start the bonding day. I think. Right, right one there. Right, uh, go to, where's the general store? General goods. Let's go there first. Uh, speak to Camilla. Manju, the Eastern Confessory that Mr. Kafai bought, brought here, okay. Azuki beans. Offer to search. Azuki adventure taken. Let's speak to her again. Purchase the onion soup. Buy. Yet we need to do some other stuff first. No, no uh, item event. We've already done that. Yes, we have. Can't do anything with that. To then enter the house located southeast right beside the pub. Okay, we'll do the shopping afterwards. Which one is the pub? Same here, station. Uh, there we go. This end. <coughs> right, here we go. Can't remember what to do, but <laughs> let's go. Damn it! 
too early. That's slowing me down. Well, we got them all. I did it. It's a new record, I know we can beat that, but we won't be doing. We've got 25 25, that'll do me. Finish. Okay, we got the hair. Oh, that's a very good question, Reen. I'd like to know the answer to that as well. All my information is the property of the Intel Intelligence Division and as such my lips are sealed. To be blunt, telling you would only serve to confusion. We can't afford to have your mind anywhere else now. Okay. A point. on a Toval over there, so we'll do Toval as a bonding event. Yep, yeah, let's do it. to talk to me anyway. Or the goddess? Yeah, who's this other goddess? side. What if that's what you're talking about, the, uh, oh, what's she called? Scarlet something, um, from Trails of Cold Steel. And uh, Trails of, Trails in the Sky. She was a bracer, wasn't she? Head rub. <laughs> uh. Nice one. Little bonding event.
Right, where would... Schwartz Mansion. Should be in the kitchen. Yes. She's sort of not a Sharon. I like Sharon. Yep. <coughs> Would you be willing to accompany me to the, the mountain path again? Can't be good, Sharon getting a weapon out. Should you choose to define the way you and your classmates fight as good? And the society of Ouroboros is nothing short of evil. Trying to fight evil such as that head on is pure folly. Okay. Right, two and part of the society, perhaps by fighting me, you can discover something that will help you stand up to them. That sounds like a good idea. Gonna get your ass kicked ringed. <laughs> I accept your challenge, really. Well, they sound like they're really going at it. Sharon showed no mercy, subjecting me to the full might of her many skills. They struggle badly to find a woman to mount a counter-attack belly in during her onslaught. Well, it's very weird, this Ouroboros thing, that they can, like, Sharon can choose to protect the Ryanford family, while the other parts of Ouroboros are siding with the opposite side. It's very weird. Until this war reaches a conclusion, I'll fight alongside you on your classmate, that's I promise. So, after the war, let's conclude it while I'm in, then, I wonder. Very strange. With conversation over, Sharon give Reem first aid for the injuries she has sustained during the battle. And together they happily return to Ymir. Okay. Right, so we have to decide who we want to speak to then. 
for the final one. Is there anything else I need to do? I think I might do Alicia. She's at the shop. Alright, let's do let's be with the Lisa then. Yes, join her. I'm sure she is, Elisa. I'm sure she is. Oh, where's he going? Give me some bonding points. After that, they sort their feet in the foot bath for a while long and enjoy some pleasant conversation. When they got out, Breen bade farewell to Elisa and chose to return to the general store. Right, so now we need to find. Ooh, I think level three. That's good. Right, who do I need to speak to for this now? I need. Need Werner in the kitchen area, where will that be? Uh, the tavern? No, oh, no, 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 it's not you. Phoenix wings in. Wild monkeys broke into the outdoor store and made off with my entire supply. What?
Try the tavern? Now we need to talk to him. <laughs> oh, well, who are these wild monkeys? And why are they stealing everything? Why is it embarrassing? Okay. Church. Come on, Lisa, where are you? He's supposed to be in the church, Septian Church. Did I just miss her? Wouldn't surprise me in the least if I did. Honestly, blind as a bat, tell you. Uh oh, we have the monkeys. I was just going to ask the same question. We really need to be here two hours later. 
Nice. Emir Manju. The hell's that? Do an almost evergreen is when I can make it another one. We just check that item was first of all. Give me here. We're still almost 2500 HP. QC will mute and sat down. Man. Trade. Trade. Evergreen. Green emblem and new material. No. Green pendulum. Need a floral bottle. Chop. Did I already buy a spark rod? I can't remember. Let's buy one of them. Buy one of those. It's a nice weapon. That done. Yes. 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 Sabbath Mass 243. Hey, super. <laughs> oh, I'm on quite a bit, mate. I'm on nearly every day. And yeah, it's not the first person that said that.
Thanks very much for the follow, mate. Cheers. Yeah, I normally stream a bit of uh, Trails of Cold Steel in the mornings. Uh, sometime, well, Tuesday, Thursday afternoons, normally Return of Reckoning. Warhammer Online, the MMO. The old MMO. Uh, occasionally some Elder Scrolls Online. to do now. I think we're nearly finished here. I think. Well, yeah, I don't think there's anything else we can do. I think we are finished. Yeah, I played uh, Trails in the Sky, and I played uh, Trails of Cold Steel Part 1, uh, the first one, and now I'm on uh, Trails of Cold Steel 2. I haven't played Crossbell though, I believe I, I should have done, but I haven't. Here's a little something from the guild. Keep it up. Very nice. This ain't half bad. Hey, why did I get an S? What am I missing? Damn it. Okay. I might just do that. Yeah, is it the, is it the uh, crossbell that gives you the inf information of what actually destroyed the uh, the fortress in this? I think it is, isn't it? Because they don't really explain what destroyed it. He's out of bed. Ah, right, okay. Um, I must have give it a look then. I shall find it. down. Yeah, it's not out on PC yet, is it Sky 3? Is it due next year? Or is it this year is due? Ah, I 
have the, I don't think they even, has it started on 40 yet to get it into English? Ah, uh, that's what I was thinking of. No, I uh, um, only played Trails in the Sky. Oh, yes, definitely, and yes. No, I didn't play SC, no. Yeah, just the first one. Came across it totally by accident, as, as I came across this totally by accident, actually. I happened to have, I was trolling through uh, YouTube, as I do, looking for RPGs to play, and uh, I found uh, a trailer for Trails in the Sky, uh, Trails of Cold Steel. I thought that looks interesting, so I thought I'd give it a go. Confirm. Ah, I'm sure I'll pick it up. <laughs> I think we're just about done. Nothing else we need to do, I don't think. Do I need to get any more stuff for the ornaments? No. I think we'll be fine. Well, we hardly use him a lot. We only use him when we need him. Forms detected. Will there be three? Thank you, Elliot. <laughs> yeah, wait a second. Yeah, somebody's missing. Why? Why is it? Why is it only two? Oh, it's got to be juice. It's got to be useless, hasn't it? He flown off with his brother. There we go. The third person on the move or aboard an airship, he won't be able to sense them. Tovel and Captain Claire prefer if one of you came along as well. Does that work for everyone? 
Oh yeah, sure, you're definitely coming, Sharon. I like you. I want to see how you perform. You'll need to choose three additional party members to accompany you to the grab. Two of these must be from class seven, while the last must be Torvo, Captain Claire or Sharon. Right, I'm taking Sharon then. Yeah, we've already done it. That's it. Yeah, that well, looks good to me. Just getting CP back in a healing. Melee damage. Avoidance tank. <laughs> and I don't know. Hopefully she got some healing and stuff. We'll see. Uh, yeah, that'll do. Me and my girls. Off we go. Still don't understand how I only got a, an A and not an SC. An S on that. Uh... That last achievement, that's confusing me that. Well, we've done everything. It's foggy. <laughs> this is not the quality of the stream, this is the game. <laughs> Higher elements, okay. That's always dodgy. Quartz in, intact? Uh, oh, not really. Tira, impede. Oh, you might as well have that. Have that. You're all still intact, yeah? My little eye. 
the goods. <laughs> this will be over in an instant. I'll handle it. Eliminating targets. In a second, that's the door. Here I go. Sorry about that. I thought it was I thought it was the door, but it wasn't, it was just mail. Nothing that we uh I need to worry about there at the moment. Uh right, where are we up to? Um Just a tag. I want to see what uh, our friend here has got to offer. Binding chains area. Suction, seal, delay plus 25. Binds prey then slashes it, attacks twice. Area. Speed minus 50, movement minus 100, three turns. Charges three fours, binding and cutting them. Tea time. Recover all. Heals 50% HP, CP plus 50. Cures ailments, delivers a couple. Oh, wow, 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 okay. Um, yeah, let's try that. It's not too shabby. And who are we uh, linked with at the moment then? That's a good point. Um, okay. Okay, I can live with that. I don't want to change it anyway. Chest wasn't wasn't there. Oh my! What a lovely chest. Flame tongue. Burn. Um, what's hair again? Uh, I'm not too worried about running from battle. I don't think. Line. It really is foggy, you can't see where you're going. Um, I'm going straight down here. Shroom. This will be over in an instant. My turn. My turn. May I? Gets eliminated. Let's get going. Uh, right, it's a chest that way. Uh, okay. We are not allowed to go for the chest yet. Need to turn right to reach the town then. Does that mean it's not gonna let us go left? <laughs> uh 
Yes. We only can only go one way at the moment, apparently. There's only we can't go down this one. <laughs> Okay, we're on rails at the moment. I can barely see where I'm going. Ha! Ha! Advantage is ours. Let's finish him. Okay. Eliminating targets. Now. Here I come. It's over. Here I go. Nice. Second form. Damn. Now's our chance. Gotcha. Very well. <laughs> right. She missed. We made it out in one piece. Uh, that's quite a nice experience. Right, left first. Chest down there. Ooh, hello. That one looks nasty. Try to be careful, everyone. Oh my! What a... Be on guard, everyone! Okay. Eliminating targets. With pleasure. How about this? Die! Let's move! Second form. Damn. Now. Might as well use it. You look a bit tough, these. Okay. Yeah, I understand. No problem. My turn. Eliminating targets. Let's move. Ha! Okay. <laughs> May I? <laughs> no problem. One piece. It's a lot of experience. Oh my, what a lovely chest. Hmm. Eight plus ten. <laughs> hmm, takes the strength down more. It's a defense up. Not you. No. Oh. Strength 25, CP recovery rate 60%. I don't want to give this to you. Yeah. Put reversion up. Uh, 
Um, right, just run there. Let's go around this way so we don't miss that monster. Oh, she's 69, Sharon. Just keep my eyes peeled for uh, fishing place as well. Yep. We got this. I think there's bound to be one in this area. to go that way do you think I wonder <laughs> the answer to that question was no it won't Well, since there's no other way to go, we'll go straight in. I spy walls. This is Laura's hometown, isn't it, Le uh, Legrand?
Right, in we go. Oh no, where's he gone? And who might you be? Miles. Miles who? Strange circumstances in Lake Ram as well. Never before seen monsters appearing on the highway. I'm sure it'll be fine. into the castle. <laughs> yes, we did indeed. Right, we need to go to the Apricors Inn, I believe. Speak to why we're behind the counter. Gambler Jack. Then take the back door to the outside.
see the food pull off. This a try. Wow, people can actually eat this. Onion soup, pure petrify. Defense and speed. Oh, that's good. Elegant pilaf. Five turns. Some KO. That's good. Uh, I need. I'm gonna get two of those. For Elisa, Okay, I think that's all we need for that. Master Quartz. Oh, hang on a sec. Uh, Altman slot.
Strength, Defense and Speed for 5 turns, that sounds alright. Dark Matter. Ah, damn it. Augment. She already had shining. Yes, yeah, she does. Unfortunate. Okay. That's what it was he. Right, okay. I'll do that. <laughs> How could you be so cruel? <laughs> oh dear, yes, was I just another name on your long list of conquests? Why, yes, Reen, please explain. <laughs> Nip into the school. spot near Klaus. Take it he's on the pier then. Who's that? That's oh, just kids. That's Klaus. Probably fish here. Uh, 
There it is. That must be a big one. Goltonus Abbas. But Bangle. do that. Uh, is there anything else we need to do? New equipment? No. Got Vivi, got Casper. Let's go. Wait to see Laura. Oh, really? Mm. That's it, change the subject, Celine. Awfully happy about seeing Emma again soon, though. I do not. Oh, I'm wondering if we have to go through all this castle again. Because if we do, we won't have time today.
Alrighty, in we go. Oh. Laura! Emma! Is that a cryptid? It looks just like the one from Nord. Oh, nice outfit, Emma. Come, Emma. We'll fight with all we have. Right! So Has he killed it? Okay. I thought we were going to have to fight that then. Man, Laura's gotten even stronger. Emma's no slouch either. Her powers never cease to amaze. <laughs> Looks like they didn't need her help after all. They're not out of the woods yet! So it seems. Oh, what the hell is that? Ultimus Lizard Zelvenon. Nom. What is that? Where did it come from? Laura! Emma! Huh? Am I imagining things? Reen! Celine! We can explain after we've taken care of things here. We'll back you two up. Ready? We're right here with you, Laura. I can't believe you're here. Very well. Then lend me your strength. Let's go, everyone. Watch out. This is a tough one. Too slow. Okay. Eliminating targets. Okay, that didn't do much. Won't do overdrive yet. My turn. Uh, I'll keep Laura. Shatter. Now's our chance. I'll back you up. Of course. Sorry for the trouble. Sorry. Not to worry. <laughs> Hmm. Don't need it yet. How about this? Die. I'll handle it. One, two. All right, let's do this. Understood. Yeah. I'll handle it. Here I go. Targets. Very well. How about this? Die. Oh, we're not seeing. Uh... Yeah. 
the aircraft yet. Uh. Shatter! Now's our chance. Our time is now. Of course, Ratchet. 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 Here I go. My turn. See, not one yet. Let's have a look. Finish it. Now. My turn. I'll handle it. My turn. Nice. We should keep going. Can't sense anything else here now. You guys okay? Y yeah. It's it's really you, isn't it? You're all here. <gasps> of course it's us. <laughs> I, I don't know what to say. This is all so sudden. Still, I'm happy to see you're well, Reen. <laughs> I'm genuinely lost for words. I've never considered myself as the sort to cry at reunions like these, but <laughs> clearly I was mistaken. Aura. I'm really sorry for making you worry about me, and I can't possibly thank you enough for fighting on so that we could see each other again like this. There's no need to apologize, Reen. I swore to fight as Class Sevens. No. As your sword, I swore that my blade would not be broken until it returned to your side. And I swear now to continue upholding every word I've said, with Adios as my witness. Thanks. I really am glad to see you're all right. And the same goes for you too, Emma. I feel the same way. I can hardly believe that this is actually happening. The day has finally come where we can all be together again. <laughs> it all feels like a wonderful dream. A wonderful dream, huh? Well, fortunately, this isn't a dream. These might be tough times for Erebonia, but we're persevering. That perseverance is what brought us together again. 
And the fact that we found each other makes everything we've been through along the way worth it. Yes, I couldn't agree more. But I know that I wouldn't have been able to come this far if not for you. Me? You accepted me despite everything. Knowing that gave me the courage to keep going. If not for that courage, I doubt I would be here now. I'm truly grateful to you, Reen. You've really grown strong, Emma. <laughs> Thank you, Celine. Thank you for all the support you've given my classmates. And thank you for coming all the way here with them to see me. <sighs> Please, it was nothing. But I'm glad you're okay, I guess. At least I won't end up astray. <laughs> Celine, there's nothing wrong with being honest about your feelings, you know. <laughs> oh, she's so happy. Right. Well, we've done what we set out to do here. There's no sign of any more cryptids, either. Might I suggest we return to Legrand for now? Count me in. You guys are fine with that too, right? That's fine by me. We can tell you more about what we've been doing since we parted ways. Then we're off to the pier! Is that us going back automatically? Do we need to run? <laughs> I hope it's auto. Nice. Much more complex, what? I've got much more complex. Okay, looks like we're going to Barai Hard next. What's wrong? I feel like I should have told you so many things a long time ago. About me, and Celine, and about Divine Knights and Awakeners. Oh. <sighs> Does that mean you're ready to tell us now? <laughs> yes, I am. It's time to finally fulfill the promise I made to you during the after party. Well, if you're sure. I imagine you've heard some of this from Celine already, but still, enrolling at Thor's was originally part of my duty as one of the Hexen clan. It's a clan of witches that traces its origins far back into the past. What kind of duty would have you enroll at a military academy? It's one that's been passed down through our clan for a long, long time. We must watch over the fragments of the great power sealed deep underground and observe whatever comes to pass regarding them, just as it did for many others before her. That duty fell to Emma as well. When you say the Great Power, you mean Balamar, right? Did both of you know about the Divine Knights this whole time? We knew of their existence, yes. As well as the fact that they choose an Awakener. And that their chosen Awakener will be drawn into an unavoidable battle. <sighs> hmm. Just because you had the potential to become one, you were drawn into a great conflict against your will. And not just you, Reen. The rest of us have become secondary contractors, and yet I couldn't say or do anything for you. 
I couldn't even give you a simple word of warning. What right do I have to call myself your classmate after failing all of you like that? Hmm. Don't be silly, Emma. Emma? Emma, you're not going to say what I think you're going to say, are you? I'm sure this isn't what you want to hear after coming all this way to find me. But this is where we should part ways. Emma. You said it yourself back in the old schoolhouse. You said Class 7 is the finest Erebonia has to offer, right? Uh. I may not always show much in the way of class spirit, but I'm confident Class 7 is the finest Erebonia has to offer. We all come from different backgrounds, and we all had things we were maybe scared to, or couldn't, tell anyone. Crow has his past, you have yours, I have this strange power of mine that I've carried with me for as long as I can remember. That doesn't directly relate to the Divine Knights in any way, does it? No, though there's always the possibility it may be one of the reasons why you were chosen. I know plenty about witches and their history, but none of that gives me a clue as to what your powers could be. All right, then. The point is that even after learning I have this monstrous power within me, you all accepted me without a second thought. I feel that I'm a part of Class 7 as much as anyone else, and I'm proud to say I am, too. Class 7 is only the best there is because it has every one of us in it. Me, Elisa, Elliot, Laura, Fee, Machias, Eusis, Gaius, Milium, Crow, and you, Emma. You're not an exception. Without you, our class wouldn't be what it is. Just like it wouldn't be if any one of us weren't a part of it. Oh, Reen, I... He's absolutely right. What he said. So I don't want to hear you say anything like that ever again. We want you right where you are. Guiding me, guiding all of us. And not just as a witch, but as the kind class president and caring friend you always have been. <laughs> Good. Good. How can I possibly refuse when you put it like that? All right, then. I can't deny the ancient knowledge that I possess or my position as a witch, but I always want to remain the same Emma Milstein of Class 7 that I have been since the day I joined Thor's. <coughs> so please, let me stay at your side. Of course. <laughs> that goes without saying. Uh, oh, Class 7 really isn't Class 7 without you in it. What a picturesque fairy tale ending. I couldn't be more pleased, and the timing couldn't have been more perfect. I can see Legram coming into view now. Would everyone mind gathering their things and... What's that? Is that an airship? It's coming from the sky to the west. Is that... Alliance airship? Wait, that's a commanding officer ship too. Indeed. Well, it seems we have ourselves some visitors. My apologies for the unexpected arrival. I should have sent word. I am Aurelia Le Guin of the Noble Alliance. I wish to make a brief visit to the territory of Viscount Arsade. Ooh, that can't be good.
It's a pleasure to see you again, your ladyship. And a pleasure to meet you as well, Brigadier General. <laughs> we were simply in the area, so we thought we might drop by and pay you a visit. It's been quite some time since we last met. I was hoping to take the opportunity to apologize to my master for not staying in touch. But I see that won't be possible. Unfortunately so. <laughs> I wouldn't have minded setting eyes on the famous Radiant Blade Master, but I suppose I'll have to be content with meeting his daughter. I'm honored, General. I can't believe they're here. Do you know them, Reen? They seem to be Provincial Army officers. Their names are General Aurelia Le Guin and Brigadier General Wallace Bardius. They're said to be the two strongest generals in the Provincial Armies. Yeah. I don't think there are many people interested in martial arts who don't know about them. That's how famous they are. Brigadier General Bardius is otherwise known as the Black Whirlwind. He's known for his unparalleled spearmanship. From what I've heard, he has Nord blood running through him too. Oh, I see. I wonder if that's how he came to be so tall. He seems pretty strong. A number of warriors from Nord were said to have fought with Emperor Dreykels during the War of the Lions. Perhaps he's a descendant of theirs? Yeah, that makes sense. As for the woman with him... She's generally known as the Golden Rakshasa. She's also a countess and head of the Le Guin family, as well as commander of the Le Maire Provincial Army. And hard as it is to believe, I've heard she's a practitioner of both the Arsade and Vander Schools of Swordsmanship. Wasn't the Vander School practiced by the Guardians of the Imperial Family? Lieutenant General Vander is a practitioner of the Vander School too, obviously. Is she even human? Both of them are key public figures in the Alliance. What could they possibly want in a neutral region such as this, I wonder? Still, it won't do to have you standing around here. Allow me to show you to my father's office. Klaus, would you prepare some tea? Oh, there's no need to concern yourself with that. Seeing that the Viscount isn't here gave us all the information that we needed. What might you be suggesting? The Eddies. We didn't come to criticize anyone for the Crimson Wing's appearance near Trista. Uh. Still, it's always good to know who you're fighting against. The way I see it, you're continuing to remain neutral now. But if it came to it, you wouldn't be afraid to take up arms for your personal sense of justice. There's no need to be hasty. We have more than enough opponents to be going on with. For now, let's focus on drawing out Craig the Red and One-Eyed Zex. We can't allow Rufus to be the only one making any major achievements. <laughs> True enough. It would please me so if you were to fight under me one day too. I believe you have the potential to surpass even me, given sufficient practice. I am honored that you would say so. However, my swordsmanship is inexperienced at best. I wouldn't dare presume to have the potential to surpass anyone at this stage. I would ask that you wait until I can at least best my father in a duel before making that invitation. Then wait I shall. I look forward to the day. With that, I believe it's time we took our leave. Perhaps so. I was hoping you would introduce us to your friends, but they seem to be feeling rather shy. <laughs> oh, he knows it there. I'm sure we'll have the opportunity one day. I sense great potential within them. As do I. I apologize for being unable to do anything to make your visit more comfortable. Klaus, please escort them. As you wish, milady. <laughs> Come to think of it, perhaps you wouldn't mind joining me in a battle before I depart. I haven't had the joy in quite some time. I hardly think an old man such as myself would prove to be a worthy opponent to one of your strength, General. Oh, I wouldn't be so sure about that. You haven't let your guard down for a second since I stepped into Legram. <laughs> <Laura>. <laughs> mm. 
<laughs> I'm sorry that you had to see me like that. It took all that I had not to be overwhelmed by their sheer presence. I'm not surprised. We could feel it well enough ourselves, and we weren't even in the room. That didn't stop them from noticing us, though. My fur was on end the whole time. They really did seem to be way beyond us in terms of skill. I wonder who'd win between them and Zeno and Leo. This just goes to show how many skilled people the Alliance has among their ranks. With warriors such as them on the field to say nothing of Lord Rufus Alborea, we can't afford to underestimate them. All very true. Still, that's no reason to give up now. We need to keep pressing on. And on that note, I think it's about time we left ourselves. Let's go and bring back Eusis. And once we've done that, then we can decide what we're going to do and who we're going to be fighting against. <laughs> Indeed. Then let's start heading to Bereahard. Already? <laughs> I'm not ready. Well, that's a good time for me to say enough for today. <laughs> we shall leave it there, guys. Um, I need to get going. I need to go and take the dog out. So, I will be back probably later on. We shall see. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget, if you're watching on YouTube, please leave a like and subscribe. It does help the channel. And we're so close to 700 subscribers on the YouTube channel. I will see you all soon. All grey, signing off.